All these Sora 2 videos are getting millions of views and today I will show you how to create your own Sora 2 videos and completely free. So let's start. So to start creating your Sora 2 videos, you just need to head over to Nano Photo AI. That's the tool we will be using in this tutorial. Once you're on the website, you just need to create your account. It only takes a minute and you will also get some free credits after signing up. Now on the main dashboard, you will find this option Sora 2 Pro Video. You can just click on it. Here we have two options to create our videos. First one is text to video and another one we have is image to video. You can also choose your video size, expect ratio. For this example, we will go with like 9 ratio 16, the vertical format that's perfect for YouTube shorts or maybe the Instagram reels. Now we need to select the Sora 2 model. You can also choose Sora 2 Pro, which is currently free for a limited time with the free credits. You can create around 10 to 20 videos depending on the models you choose. Now you will see a box where we can enter the prompt. This tool also includes Sora 2 prompt generator which helps you describe the scene and generate a detailed prompt automatically. But I prefer using ChatGPT to write my prompts that usually gives a much better result. So for this example, I will ask ChatGPT to create a Sora 2 prompt for a person saying subscribe to Shubhavs. That's my YouTube channel. ChatGPT then gives me a prompt like this. A confident man, young man standing in a futuristic neon lit studio surrounded by floating holograms. We can now just copy this prompt and go back to nano photo and paste it into the prompt box and click on generate video. Now it will start creating our video. The generation process usually takes around 2 or 5 minutes depending on the model. The pro models take a bit longer but gives a high quality results as well. So we choose Sora 2 normal model so it will take around 2 or 5 minutes to create. Once it's done you will see the video automatically here. So now you can see here our video is ready I think and now you can see this is our video preview center subscribe to shubops for more amazing center subscribe to shubops for more amazing ai and tech tools this is the final output you can see it automatically generate the text the music background music and even the voice over so it's like a very great model i think for the video generation you can also create Sora 2 videos directly using OpenAI, but those often include watermark. That's why I'm suggesting this tool. We will also talk about watermark later in this video. Now let's try creating some another theme, maybe a funny one. For that, I will uh, again go to ChatGPT and uh, rewrite. I need something different, maybe something funny or anything like that. So we will get another prompt and we can try that prompt as well. So you can see here, this is the new prompt that we are going to try. So this is kind of like a funny prompt. So now let's see what's the final result from this prompt. So this is our final output. You can watch it first. You forgot to subscribe to Shubop. Okay, okay, I'm subscribing. You forgot to subscribe to Shubop. You forgot to subscribe to Shubop. Okay, okay, I'm subscribing. I think this one was pretty good. Now we can just download the video from here and we can even create more videos. Now let's talk about another tool. We also got remove watermark too, where we can create remove the Sora videos watermark. If you have some previous videos or you created using OpenAI and those has watermark, you can just remove it from here. Now let's talk about the pricing plans. The basic plan starts at $15 per month, which is great for individuals and creators as well. There's also a $10 plan with the 67 credits where each Sora 2 videos cost around 2 credits. That means you can create about 33 regular videos or around 4 pro videos. Plus, if you use my coupon code SHUBOPS, you will get free 100 credits and an extra 10 or 20% discounts as well. Finally, if you check out the gallery tab, you can view all your past generation and downloads. That's it for this tutorial. If you have any questions or know a better tool to test, let me know in the comments. I would love to cover it next. Thank you so much for watching.